podcast and they're on it this free next Tuesday and you like to get some garden. Yeah, did you say I'm free next Tuesday? Yeah, I, you're always free. I sure am. Uh, undefined done. Intro song done. Transition done. Hi, guys. Fuck, fuck that guy, Nero. <laughs> fuck me. Oh, fuck God. me, dude. Fuck me so hard. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um totally getting demonetized. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> totally oh. getting demonetized. Already. Yeah. Already, dude. It's the it's within the first 10 minutes, the first uh Oh actually like... no, I'm not demonetized. It's past the first minute of the video. We're okay. It's okay. It's not like I make money off YouTube. <clears throat> what about me being free next Tuesday? Oh god. I asked you if you're free next Tuesday and you just ignored me. When did you ask me that? Earlier in chat. In the chat, in the chat rooms. Are are you also Neron? Are you gonna be busy the night before you leave? Oh yeah. And Mark was like Agua. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, uh, oh yeah. I I completely skipped the Mark. What are you drinking tonight? And then skip to Mark saying, "Why is this a drinking stream?" I skipped both of your responses right after that. Yeah, I'm free next Why? week. Why? What's up? Yeah, dinner. Yeah, dinner before you leave. Okay, just not Japanese food. <laughs> all right we're gonna get a uh, super japanese food i guess we're gonna get american food we're gonna get get, get mexican psych that's getting, way too heavy dude we're getting japa dog xd <laughs> X that's actually not that bad it's a hot dog <laughs> it's not that bad but anyways welcome back to the neon podcast episode 124 we yeah, 124 guys um yeah, we're fi we finally we're still here in the one twenties. We oh, should be in the one thirties, but we're not. Um, yeah, why yeah. not? Yeah, because couldn't find guest. Mark's playing Genshin in the background. Hey, why he keeps whispering to his mic? I don't know. Yum <laughs> <laughs> yum. <laughs> heal heal heal. <laughs> Anyways, uh, back again this week. Same guest as last week. It's my boys, the baby cakes. Who wants to really introduce is. him? Who's introduced themselves first? Yeah, Mark, introduce yourself. All right, we're the boys. The boys in motion. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! I've heard that intro be used before. Oh god. Okay, boys in motion. Who are you? Who are you? My name is Chad. <laughs> <laughs> I totally forgot their names, bro. I'm not even gonna yeah, lie. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Is that actually his name? <laughs> nah. <laughs> Boys in... I gotta look this up, dude. Boys in motion members. Oh, it's fuck. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, never mind. Forget it. I'm not even gonna remember, dude. Anyways, that's that's Chad, a.k.a. Mark. Um, And joining me, still technically co-host, I guess. I mean, you're here now. You know, who yes. are you? Who are you, co-host? Yes, it's, it's me. Yes, nice. Nice. <laughs> Are you even watching? <laughs> it's me, nice. That's nice. It's me, your boy camp. It's it's your boy camp. The real boy in motion. Yeah, always in motion. Yeah, that's that's how he is, man. He's always in motion. Anyways, welcome back, everyone, to the Young Podcast. I don't really have a set topic to about that topic to talk about i can't english that well per usual but dude you know what i realized last week what we didn't talk about or last episode snowboarding yeah we didn't talk about fucking snowboarding <laughs> it's been over it's been a month and a half since we went snowboarding we haven't even talked about it to anyone other than like my co-workers that i talked to when i came back from work or get, went back to work did we really go snowboarding or is it just a figment of your imagination I mean, there's photos. I can't fabricate that in my imagination unless I'm like fucking brainiac. Fake. fake. It's not actually you. A fake, dude. Me. It's a deep fake, dude. <laughs> it's a deep fake. There's. I wasn't actually there. I just uh, transplanted digitally my face onto someone else's face and uh, made it look like I was uh, in the snow. They just took a picture of you with your mask on, and then they took like the top part with your eyes, and then they put it on. To they they re they retroscope that shit. Yeah. Oh they no. Crop that shit out. Oh <laughs> my god. Well, yeah, we didn't we we didn't talk about it until like you know now. People actually asked about. It. They're like, "Oh, dude, I hyped it up so much. How come you're not talking about it?" I'm like, "I did hype it up a lot. I hyped. I was excited." Yeah. 
you did hype it up a lot i did not wouldn't say a lot but i hyped it up at minimum like yeah. hi hype is definitely the word because i was excited and i was like yeah we're going snowboarding we watch all these videos and all that stuff mm -hmm. and then we spent more time in the car than more time on the snow so it was uh it was definitely an experience i'll tell you that yeah dude i mean long story short here's what happened you know we woke up early on a saturday morning well kemp didn't really wake up he came home from work on an early saturday morning we picked up mark from his city on the way to big bear we drove there the drive there was actually really nice i'm not gonna lie the drive there was actually really really nice too bad kemp was asleep for like half of it and then i got oh, yeah. pull i got pulled the over scenery. yeah the scenery was actually dude and the drive was actually super enjoyable i mean i don't kemp were you asleep when we were going up the mountain mm, i think for the um, i think for the most part i was asleep i think i, I was i was awake at like when we started going up and then i fell asleep again mm, okay so i mean so that so i mean either you're really tired or you're easily you can fall asleep easily in a car oh yeah i can definitely fall asleep easy in a car that's impressive i can't do that i mean mark you're a shotgun you were awake the whole time i mean did you was the was the drive okay for you being in the front seat watching the entire like up and down lefts and rights and stuff yeah the scenery was so good actually yeah every time we'd look we like oh shit <laughs> i would take a quick glance because there were there weren't any straight roads for me to look at <laughs> you tell me like uh this is not the scenery mark <laughs> i'm like but but it is to me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't I can't look at the scenery. I I would take a look like a quick one second glance, then I had to immediately put my eyes back on the road because there was like cars in front of us, cars behind us. I can't slow down. Um, different elevations. It was actually really nice. It it looks way better in person than it does on my phone, guaranteed. <laughs> so Were you wait, you took a picture while you were driving. No, Mark took oh, a video was... on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> like i gave mark my phone while we were driving and i was like hey mark can you take a couple of uh videos or photos and he was like yeah i looked at it, i looked it back i went maybe should have asked to zoom in but again <laughs> because it's like i didn't know how to utilize my new phone cameras like because you know freaking i have an iphone 14 pro right um small flex but whatever I, i'm an adult um and it has like three different cameras to use i didn't know how to fully utilize the cameras yet because i was like i only had the phone for like a week and I haven't gone out to use it for like photography or videography yet. Then I was like, I don't know how to use this. Mark, just record something. <laughs> so you recorded it, but I'm like, it looked way better in person than it did on my phone. So I mean, Mark can that, tell you that, more about it. That's kind of how it's going to be, right? Wait, what'd you get? Would you? I missed both of what you said. <laughs> I mean, that, that's how it should be, right? It should look better in person, right? I mean, unless you're good at videography, but. You know, then you can make it look good and even on the phone. But uh yeah. Crease. Oh no, I miss Neon when he's on the other side of the world. It's, you can miss me now. Right, Camp? No. Fuck you. No, no, yeah, fuck you. Fuck this guy. He's don't never miss. gonna deep, deep. miss him when he says he's gonna stay in Japan. Oh shit. Imagine if I stayed in Japan, no way. Yeah, that's what my friend said. He he actually just came back from Japan last weekend. Dude, I, I don't know if I would want to live in Japan. Maybe I'll live in Japan if I actually knew the language. Otherwise, you won't. True, true. Not yet. Um, but Mark, what were you saying earlier? Oh, I just said point five. Point five. The camera thing. Is it point five or is it times three? I don't, I don't know. know for the, you know. Oh, ugh. for the photos and video. Yeah. Yeah. And. I mean, the drive up there was nice. The drive down was ass because we had to take the long way around, even though it's, oh, yeah. it would still save us an hour. That's kind of crazy, right? Like, imagine going the short route and it's, it's only like 80 miles or 85 miles, but it would have taken four hours. If we went the long way around, that was like 120 miles. So like 45% longer, but it took a whole hour less. That's what, that's what we ended up doing. Yeah. Did you say... Yeah. This is how GTA looks like. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Because I realized, okay, so I, so there's like certain points. Have you, have you guys played GTA 5? I know, actually, Mark, yeah, you That's, Mark played yeah. GTA 5. Do you play GTA 5 at all, Kemp, or do you know the map? Yeah, I know the map. Okay, so basically the mountain in GTA, I think, is Big Bear. 
because it's based off LA, right? Because yeah, because yeah. yeah, oh, well, obviously Los Santos, whatever, is uh, LA. But you know, I didn't realize how much of like it was actually Southern California because I was like, oh yeah, it's just the mountains. I don't know what's over there. And then I realized it went over there. I went, fuck, dude. It there really is just a giant ass lake and then desert and then flatlands. <laughs> and I went, this is just GTA. <laughs> So I was unfortunately in GTA. There's no snow, yeah. No, by default, snow, yeah. So I couldn't tell, but it's still really, really, really nice scenic route all around. Um, going up and down Big Bear, even at night, even though we couldn't see much, I, it was still really nice. Um, drive. Although I was like had to be hyper focused, make sure we were all safe and stuff, not get into an accident. You know, we're all here, so we're okay. But yeah, am I really here? <laughs> <laughs> it was a figment of your imagination. <laughs> it's all a simulation, bro. Did I actually just die up there? <laughs> your your body came oh, down, no. but your soul didn't leave. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, I mean, what? Okay. It it was my second time snowboarding, but it was your guys's both first time snowboarding. What do you, you guys should talk about the trip more than me right now? What What do you guys think? Like, because we obviously went to the shop. We got fitted for our boots and stuff and our helmets and then we went up and then what did you guys think when we got up there? It was, it was crazy. Cold. <laughs> it was cold. Okay, guys. Okay. Cold. I'm from Southern California. It's cold. <laughs> yeah, from the, the heat. It was cold. It was cold. Um, okay. I, I don't know if you... I, we already said already, but uh, the, when when we went there, it was, uh, it was like a kind of like a semi snowstorm when we first got there. Yeah, it was like drizzling. Yeah, like drizzling, yeah, and then, then like, stopped. yeah, it stopped, and then like, and, like I think it was like, <laughs> an, hour, an hour after it just like, like it started getting like, worse and worse. Boom, boom, boom <laughs> like the wind was pushing me, and uh, crazy worse. Couldn't get up, and I was trying to learn how to snowboard. Okay, so before the the storm actually hit, what did you guys think of trying to learn how to snowboard before the storm hit? Because it was pretty, it was relatively calm, but when we started, it was difficult. It was fun. It was difficult. I'm uh, I learned very little. So basically, My ass ate even everything. after all those videos. <laughs> so basically, kept <laughs> wish he had li life alert. <laughs> Oh, he needed way more than life alert, bro. I wish uh, I had someone next to me holding my hand the whole time. Yeah, he needed an adult. <laughs> I needed an adult, yep. Yep. Did, but did you have fun, though? Mark said he had fun. I had fun, yeah. I had fun with the boys, you know? Yeah. Okay. Okay, question. This, is, this goes for either of you. Did any of the YouTube or Instagram videos we sent help you at all? Um, it helped me on the lift. Nice. Yeah, the lift. Yeah, the, lift part. <laughs> the, the scariest part, the it's, lift. Yeah, it, that's the lift. important part. <laughs> yeah, that's, that, that's kind of important. Okay, so I'm not even going to lie to you. I was like super proud of you guys like not falling going down the lift. <laughs> I was, yeah, like, I was actually it. so fucking proud. I went, oh my god, you didn't fall! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, on the lift. Um, that, that, that helped a lot. Um... Apart from that, uh, I, I think I needed more time up the hill. Uh, that makes sense, though. We had limited time. Yeah. I think if we had more time, we would have got it. Dude, I swear, we were only there for like less than two hours, right? No, we were there for three. Oh, we were there for three? It felt like less than two hours. Well, we were, we were on the snow for three, but we were on our boards for like two, two and a half. Oh, okay. Because, you know, like we were, we have to, for the intro lesson, we had to walk up and then we had to make sure yeah, we, we could we could walk with a one boot on you know yeah we're just going up and down a lot well i mean that's snowboarding isn't it yeah that's true i mean like you can't really snowboard on flat it's not a skateboard were, 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 were people still there after we left no like they i looked on the website with my limited yeah. data they they closed like 90 percent of the lifts yeah oh, wow. they were like yeah, it's it's way too dangerous for people to be out so they're like no, no good. Unless you're like absolutely like a pro, they're probably not gonna let you up. Yeah, I wanted to ride the lift again. <laughs> was that the fun part? Yeah, it was kind of fun, you know, just sitting down, relaxing. 
Yeah, but then we ended up taking the little little conveyor belt up halfway up. Yeah, that, that was fun. I was scared I was going to fall on that more than the actual snow. Yeah, I was scared uh, that I was going to like slip down or something. It's just a people mover. Do you people even mover. do you even lift, bro? Here, watch this video so you don't perish on your attempt. No. Yo, everyone's going to perish on their attempt. That's snowboarding. That's like a guarantee. There's no way you don't perish. I mean, Mark, what about you? Like yeah, did... unless you don't have legs, you know. Maybe maybe you'll perish. Yeah. I mean, what about you, Mark? Like, did you you said you had fun. Did you were you able to apply anything other than the lift to your snowboarding first time experience? No, it's going down way too fast. <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah, I, I'm prepared I was... to weight shift and do all this thing and shift my heel toe heel. <laughs> nah, I was just going straight down. <laughs> Yeah, I was I was I was terrified of going down too fast and like not knowing how to like, stop. <laughs> yeah, like hitting my like head head first into like a child or something. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see. I mean, it's bound to happen. Like, did you guys have any severe falls where you felt super sore afterwards? Because I did. I actually had a couple bad falls. Bro, when we got to the top of the lift, uh, my first like try to go down once. Do I like? I swear, I thought I like fucking broke my leg or something. Holy <laughs> shit! What? Yeah, I, I, I like, I thought I broke my leg, and then uh, uh, it, it, it didn't break. It just hurt a bit. <laughs> oh my god! Just, it's because like, it, it's because you didn't you didn't have both your legs in the board, huh? Yeah. It, it, it like uh, it recoiled, balance or something. Yeah, it was uh, it was kind of rough. I was sitting there for like a good minute or two. That's why you were just there. I was like, you didn't say anything. You were just like, uh. <laughs> uh yeah. Uh, <laughs> you were like, you, Cap, you, you okay? You're, uh. <laughs> you're, you're like, you're like twenty five feet away from me, and there was like a, it was like raining, drizzling, whatever. I didn't want to shout. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Chris, are you supposed to break by putting your snowboard in defense position? Correct. You gotta put in defense position. <laughs> um. <laughs> I mean, so you so you almost broke your leg. What about you, Mark? Oh, it, it felt like I broke my leg, but I don't think I broke my leg at all. <laughs> it just like a, it was like a sharp pain, like for a little bit, and then it went away. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Good, good, good. No, no lasting effects. What about you, Mark? I think I like sprained my thumb, like you know, and then it forces <laughs> back. How, how did that happen? Why didn't you mention? It's... Why did neither of you mention this the day of? Because my no, hands were like when, frozen. <laughs> when 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 we got back, my like legs were sore, and it it, it was it was like that. So, oh yeah, you said that the next day. You woke up, you're like, my legs are I was, sore. I like, limping, dude. I was like limping, dude. Yeah. But you said you didn't have a bruise either, though, huh? Yeah, it's a bruise. It was just sore, I guess. Oh, okay. I, I thought my I thought my legs would actually be like fine. I thought I'd, like my arms would. I was more scared of my arms, you know. Uh, like the wrist like, thing. Yeah, I don't want to break my wrist because I, I I walk a lot, so I thought my legs would be okay. No, that's what I thought too when I first like when I like worked out at home. I would be like the same thing, be like, oh yeah, I run and I work out. Like I'd be fine at Disneyland. I go to Disneyland for a full day. I'm like fucking dead. I'm like my workouts did nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, but what about you, Mark? Like you you said you almost brained your thumb. How did that happen? Like you know when you like push back your thumb all the way back? Okay. Yeah, yeah it was hurting. You fell on your hand? Yeah. Oh, left or right? My right. Oh no. And you just didn't say anything? Uh, because after that, like, you know, it started getting colder, so my hands are like freezing. So I couldn't really like feel my hands, like it was just numb. So it and nat the n nature naturally numbed you out and you were okay yeah. did it swell at all were you okay no i was good yeah okay yeah my fingertips were frozen wearing like wearing my gloves was pretty Ooh. bad because it was when it's wet yeah it was so bad but it. then you would take it off and then it'd be worse because your hands it, it, are, yes. because because of the wind shear it was so bad and, and then it goes inside the glove too 
Let me take it out. <laughs> oh, yeah, that shit was worse. Because it's like, sometimes I couldn't have the finesse to, with my gloves putting my bindings on the board. So I took my glove off, and then it would make my hand cold. And then I'd be yeah. like, okay, I need to put my hand back in the glove. But then my gloves wet, so then it'd just get even colder. And it would take like a whole like 10 minutes to warm up again because my, my hand didn't have body heat, dude. This shit sucked. Man, it was... It was rough, but I think like even with our limited time, I think I still had some decent fun. I worked out a lot. I kept pushing myself to get down the mountain the fastest. I'm like, okay, I fell. Get up. <laughs> yeah, that, that that's uh, that's how it is. So right now, the snowboard, I guess you just gotta keep getting up. Yeah, because it's like, um, did you? I know, I don't know, I don't. Well, Mark doesn't watch anime right now, but are you caught up on Blue Lock Camp? Yeah, I caught up on Blue Lock. Yeah, dude, it's like Kunigami, dude. Just like don't, don't look down. If you look down, it's over. <laughs> oh, can't that snowboarding right there, dude? You give up, it's over, dude. <laughs> you gotta look up. <laughs> you gotta keep your head up. Yeah, look up. Ah, yeah. oh, jeez. And then, yeah, man. Yeah, we got, yeah, we got back. Uh, I think we got back at like six or seven ish or something. Yeah. The Mexican food was really good. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. We waited a while, but it was pretty good. Because I was, I was like, I didn't realize you were gonna order another thing because you just really wanted pupusas. Yeah, I wanted to try. I wanted to compare to my my homies' uh, pupusas. And oh yeah, we didn't ask. What what did you think? Uh, that's all right. I mean, like compared to it, yeah, I the 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 pupusa itself was like. Uh, it's about the same, but I think the sauce was better from uh, my friend. Mm -hmm. Hey, you took it home, right? You took home the other one. Yeah, but I didn't eat the other one. I gave it to my oh. sister. Oh, for sure. I was like, eh, it's pupusa. I've had pupusas. I still have like I still had the carne asada fries, yeah. and I think I took something else home. What I took something? I took three things home. I don't remember what it was. You took everything, dude. <laughs> What'd you say, Mark? Wasn't the quesadilla? Yeah, yeah that's what it was. Too. Yeah, I, I took the case. That's what it was. It was the quesadilla, like a third of the carne asada fries and pupusa. I ate the quesadilla when I got home. I gave the pupusa and a sixth of the carne or a fifth of the carne asada fries to my siblings. I was like, dude, I'm good. Because you because we woke up, we had fucking big ass breakfast, dude. Holy shit. It wasn't even, it was like I thought it was just gonna be one meal. It was honestly two meals at the same time. Why would you make so much food, you and your parents, bro? I appreciate yeah. it and I love it, but that was too much. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a Filipino hospitality. God damn, woke up, we had what? Had waffles, pancakes. What did we have? I can't French French. Stuff. What did we eat? Pancakes, waffles, oh, waffles. fried rice, bacon. Fried rice was good like too. Some pot roast. Oh my god, dude! Pot roast for fucking breakfast. I was like, no way. I was like brunch. Yeah, I was like brunch. Yeah. I know, but it was so good, but it was so much. I'm like, I can't, I want to eat everything, but the Mexican food from yesterday is still weighing on my stomach. I didn't poop it out yet. <laughs> <laughs> who made the pot roast? Honestly, was that, who, who's, whose recipe for pot roast was that? That's my dad's. Damn, he made some good ass pot roast, dude. Honestly, so good. The pressure cooker OP. Or a yeah. slow cooker, whatever. Uh -huh. Opie. Opie, Opie. Tell your parents again, thanks. That was really good. <laughs> fucking, I ate a whole half a potato, dude. Pot roast for brunch. I know, right? That's fucking crazy. Uh, I'm just thinking about that goddamn breakfast again. I'm I'm feeling heavy right now. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god. I keep thinking about it. I'm like, I have a bowl of pot roast, a fucking waffle, like 10 eggs. Strips of bacon. Oh God! Why are my mouth watering? <laughs> the, uh, my, my my parents probably thought you uh, probably remember you as a big eater. But I didn't really like. Everything. I never really ate with them before. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Like I didn't. Nah, you're, you're a big eater, dude. They, that's what they think. Dude, ten eggs. <laughs> I ate at camp's house before. Oh yeah, he did. Oh no, I ate at Kemp's house before too. Like mom's uh, Kemp's mom got mad at me because I was playing League on his computer. <laughs> she got mad at you? I think she got mad at me. 
<laughs> I was like, uh, Naron, come eat. I was like, I was like, Kemp's in the bathroom. You should come get your food. I'm like, uh, I can't. I'm I'm in the middle of a game. She went, pause the game. I went, uh, I can't. <laughs> this is like, this is high school, by the way. This is in high school. Oh, yeah, it is a classic pause the game. You can't pause, yeah. And yeah. then, and then I didn't know what happened. Your computer straight up dumped. It crashed. <laughs> they went. It crashed. Your computer crashed. It was your old computer, like your shitty one that ran at like thir- twenty-seven frames. Bro, that shit never crashed. League, what the hell? Yeah, it crashed when I played it. I don't know what Maybe. happened. It crashed. Maybe. Then I went. Well, game's done. I guess I'll go eat. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, but that's different. That's the. I think that's the only time I've actually ate with like. Not Kemp's family, but I ate at Kemp's dining table. Yeah. That's the only yeah. time, yeah. That's why I like single player games that let you pause. No, Chris. Always always play competitive games. Live. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's go play some genius invocation or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go play your Genshin somewhere else. Uh I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> Genshin gives light approval. <laughs> Um, dude, dude, man, um, Mark, what did you eat at Kemp's yeah. house? You ate with what his family? Uh, yeah. When was, ago? when was this? When was that, Kemp? When we, like, recorded your thing? Yeah, it was with Mark and Antonio. Oh. oh I was with this Matt. That's when Matt, Matt spilled Matt, the Matt. Coke. <laughs> yeah, it was Matt spilled the Coke. <laughs> Oh, dude, I still don't know the story behind this. I still don't know the story behind this. What's the story? He, he spilled the Coke. He, uh, we, 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 I gave him the, the Coke bottle, the, the liter bottle, and uh, put some Coke, and then he, it like, spilled it. spilled it all over the table. Motherfucker. Oh, <laughs> it was on the table. Okay, I thought he spilled it, like, on your carpet, bro. I'm like, holy shit, that's so bad. I don't think we had carpet at the time. We were eating with Kemp's dad. Yeah. Damn. And he just spilled the entire bottle? Uh, not the entire bottle. But like he, he knocked like, it over? Yeah, he like knocked yeah. it over. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought it this was, was a different story of like, spilled, he spilled like a can of Coke on someone's carpet at a party or something. Oh, no, dude. That's, uh, that would be yikes. Yeah, I, I think we had hardwood for it by then. Okay. That's why I'm just like, that's what the story was? Every time we brought it up, the Coke, he would like, no, not the Coke. <laughs> I was like, the hell is he talking about? This This would happen every time in like senior year, whenever we ha- we hung out and had like, like don't split the Coke. <laughs> yeah, because we, we would have like dance practice for like Eminem and JB or whatever, right? Or like Diane's debut or something. And you're like, you guys want to drink soda, Coke? They're like, we would, we would all look at Mark Coke. <laughs> You're like, no, no, not the Coke. <laughs> and then, and then when he actually did, we would all drink Coke sometimes, like from the can, and we would just put it on like a chair or the floor or something. Be like, hey, is this your Coke? Yeah, don't, don't, don't knock it over. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually really funny at the time because it's, it's funny because I didn't even know the context, but I would tease him about it. So. Oh. And would uh did have, have any of you guys actually like uh talked to him uh, uh recently or nope I chat him you do how often not that much once in a blue moon a blue moon yeah oh, all right all right yeah I don't really talk to um oh my god can we talk about this. Fucking, are you the ten year high school reunion? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> can we talk about this right now? I actually kind of want to talk about this on podcast. Me and Kemp, me and Kemp, had this whole half the ride home from your house yeah. after Big Bear Mark was me and Kemp talking about people from high school. Not even gonna uh-huh. lie, that shit was like the most entertaining conversation I had in person for a long time. How did how did it start? I think it started like, hey, do you know this person has a kid? Uh, or like, <laughs> yeah. But we always do that now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we do that now. Cause like, like oh, who's married? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Oh, I remember. No, no, no. Actually, that's not how it started. It started off as um, someone uh, posting their engagement photos on Instagram. Yeah. That's yeah. who it was. I think it was Kiana. I think, yeah, Kiana's the one who got engaged during our Big Bear trip. And then Kemp's oh, like, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah. I th- yeah, I think you're, 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 you're like, yeah. 
Yeah, I'll be lurking. Thanks, Chris. Um, yeah, I was like something. I think I think that's the right person. I I know there's a girl from our high school, and I was like, you know, she's gonna, she's engaged now. She's gonna get married. And I was like, and Kemp was like, who's that again? <laughs> yeah, I, I I did not remember who who that person was. I, I probably still don't. <laughs> You'll see them and be like, oh, right, you're that person. Uh, right. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> it's been 10 years, all right? <laughs> of course, of course. It's been 10 years already, dude. Dude, I actually now, like, the more we say it, the more that it becomes real to me that it's been 10 years. Because it's like, I don't, I still consider myself a kid when I was in college, even though I'm legally an adult. I'm just like, no, I'm still a kid, dude. I don't I don't have fucking responsibilities other than fucking school, right? Yeah, but yeah. Uh, it's like you're in school and you're like you're not even living at home no more, right? Exactly. But it's <laughs> you like gotta take, you gotta take care of your own meals or uh Yeah, but that, I mean if you got a car, you know, whatever, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah, but I was like a broke college student, right? I was like, I'll just stay at home, <laughs> play video games, eat cup of noodles, I'd occasionally cook my own meals, and then go to my classes and go to clubs. I'm just like, yeah, dude, it's just the same thing without family, and it's more expensive. <laughs> it's more expensive. More expensive, dude. Fucking, I had to pay six seventy five for a double, dude. I knew people in like other schools that were paying six seventy five for a spacious single. I was so jealous. I was so jealous. I don't even remember how much I paid for in uh, college anymore. I just know it financially covered it. <laughs> oh man, that's jealous. <laughs> yeah. And I don't know. What about you guys? Like, would, would are you guys gonna go to the actual high school reunion? I know. I know. Kemp said he'd go if I go, but Mark said you're you're still iffy, dude. You're still iffy. Yeah, I'd never go by myself. Fuck that. <laughs> oh, yeah, I would never go by myself. Just peer straight up. You're not gonna go. Yeah, I I gotta know someone going, or I gotta be like kind of close to someone going. You know, that's fair. Mark, you're not gonna go if we go. Uh, oh no! Is there gonna be one? I think there should be. If last year's had one, I feel like we should have one. Yeah, but who organized last year? Oh, I should ask Gerard that. Is yeah. it the student council or something like that? I don't know if it was student council or the actual school. Who, who, who was like the art class president? Was it Shamaya? The fuck? Why would you say Shamaya? Oh, you mean like, oh. <laughs> Didn't we have a class president or something? So we had, there was the, the student council thing. There was student council. Then there was the, what was the program that they were part of? The ABS? What is it called? ABS. What was the acronym? What's the acronym? ABS CBN. <laughs> no. <laughs> fucking racist, bro. You fucking racist. <laughs> oh my gosh. Really? 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> I what no seriously though what's the <laughs> stop laughing I, I, no I don't remember I think it was um wasn't it one of the girls what? from the um... <laughs> wasn't it one of the girls from um um what is the what is the teaching one a a t c a a e e turf <laughs> what I I don't remember dude honestly it's been ten years. <laughs> The abs. Ab what's the what's the <laughs> fucking acronym, bro? I know you know the acronym. What is it? ABBS. Is that what? it? What the fuck is ABBS? That's way too many letters. All right, all I, all I remember is ASA. Okay. No, I'm not not. I'm not talking about the fucking academies, dude. I'm not talking about the academy. I'm talking about it was like a club, but it was like student council. That's why you think Shamaya was president. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> It's been oh, 10 years. I, forgot. Yeah, I told I don't what remember. the fuck is the name of the goddamn... It was like a club that they also took for a class. If Because they would they would do like the... um. Oh, I totally forgot oh, yeah, what it was. They did that whole thing. Like they were the ones who did oh. all the prep rallies and stuff. The pep rallies. Yeah. yeah that's what, what I'm talking about. Because that's not student council. That's something else. Because I wasn't part of that one. What was that one? I don't know. <gasps> I, I know there was an acronym for it. There was a three-letter acronym. 
Ah, oh, whatever. But yeah, that wasn't student council. I was like, Shemaya, Shemaya wasn't even in fucking student council, bro. I, I remember he was like a president or something, right? Yeah, and it, and it was the it's the thing that I'm talking about. I, I don't remember the acronym for the letters. Like it's not, it, I forgot, dude. But you know, it it was that one. I'm pretty sure it was that one. He was a president of. Because I don't remember Shemaya being involved in much else in school in terms of like yeah. extracurriculars. This guy would just work out. Because <laughs> he was he was like the second buffest guy in the fucking in our friend group. If not the buffest, so. You think Shamaya would go? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Shamaya would go. That's guy, that guy's been off the radar, dude. Yeah, I haven't seen Shamaya. Maybe Lawrence knows. You think Lawrence is gonna go? <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna keep going. I don't think. I don't think. I don't think Lawrence is gonna go. I don't think Lawrence. You... Okay. Let's... Pick a name. Who would see who would go? Okay, okay. Let's. Yes, all right, we're, we're already going down this list. Would Lawrence go? No. Okay. No. Okay. All right. So pick um, someone who is who you associate with Lawrence. Mary. Would Mary go? <laughs> Mary, damn, I haven't seen her. Uh, I, I think she would go if the others go. So, yeah. Yeah. I think I think that's what a lot of people would do if. Uh... Someone they were like kind of close to when they would go. Okay, so if Mary would go, if who went? Who is who is the people? Who's that Mary... best friend? <laughs> I don't know who is Mary's best friend. Is it Sam? Tall Sam? Yeah. Is that her best friend? Bula Bula Tao. I so, I think I still have her on Instagram. <laughs> her? Um, would maybe. she Would she go? She go. If someone else goes, who's that? And who's her best friend? Who's her best? <laughs> what is that? Are you talking about girl Francis? <laughs> That's the only person I can think of. Is it girl Francis? Yeah. Or yeah. or or Anne. Anne. You don't remember Anne? Anne. What was her? Yeah. I don't remember. I don't remember her last name. Oh, was I think Dennis. I think I yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I know. Yeah, I, I remember her. It was one. It's one of them too. Wow, but... Sometimes gossiping about uh, high school people. <laughs> yeah, because I'm just, I'm trying to like remember people because I have some of them on Instagram still that I occasionally see their posts or their story. That's why like I'm trying to remember people. So you not... you think they'd go as like a trio or like a quad? Yeah, maybe if they're still talking. It's been ten years ago. <laughs> Some tea. <laughs> some tea. Yeah, I mean, that's true. Actually, I don't see them post about each other too much. Yeah. Do, yeah. do, 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 do you see? Oh, you, so you you follow them on social then? And... Well, I don't say fo uh, technically. I follow them. I don't follow them actively. Like I don't. The based off my algorithm, I don't see all their posts. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. But yeah. but yeah, but but from what you see, you don't. They don't really uh, post about each other. I guess. Yeah, I mean, like they the don't. Last three years, four years. Yeah, I mean, they also uh -huh. don't post too much about their daily life, you know. Yeah. They're 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 those are, uh, their type of posts. Like they'll post when something's happening, but yeah, they won't I mean, post anything like, mundane like me. Yeah, it's like twenty twenty three. Like I mean, assuming people graduate like twenty seventeen, twenty eighteen, twenty nineteen, it's like a good like, six four to six years. Dude, a lot of I, these. I, I, oh, go ahead. I don't, I don't expect like everyone to like actually stick together, you know, like. Why the fuck am I still talking to you? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking, you fucking love us, bro. Let's admit it, bro. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I, talk, I, I still talk to a good amount of people from high school, dude. Like, well, Josh Evangelista was like, I mean, he's been a homie since before high school, so he's 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 like, yeah, he's your Osana he, Nanaji. Yeah, he's my Osana Nanaji, me, bro. He's he's like one of the exception to the rules, but like, I still talk to Sam. I literally just hung out with Sam last week. On TFTI. You were at work. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what you think. What the fuck? <laughs> damn, damn. Were you were you free? Is that Riverside? <laughs> oh yeah, TFTI. that's true. You're at Riverside fucking Saturday, that's right. Bitch. TFTI. Um I knew that. Uh I still I still hang out with Anthony. Anthony is like a semi rare case because he wasn't in our year, but Yeah. Is um, Anthony in the chat? Is Anthony in the chat? Antionitis, is he there? 
Mr. Yeah, Giga Chag of gift I'm gifting gonna, subs. He with a sub right now. I know. He's, I don't <laughs> think he's here. It's fine. Um, who else? We still well again. Rare case he's not. Are you Roger Gerard? I still see them on socials and stuff. I'll yeah, talk really to them. Gerard went to his uh, high school reunion, dude. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but I, but I reconnected him be- with him because he streams on Twitch. That was the reason right. why. Right. Um. Who else? Who else do I hang do, out do, with? Do you like reconnecting with like your old friends? If they were cool friends to begin with, I'm cool with reconnecting with them. <sighs> but if it's like if I wasn't really cool with them, like on that level, it's harder for me to reconnect with them because I'm like, did you change at all? Did you grow? Because if I interact with them on occasion, like throughout these past capital past couple of years, I'll be like, oh yeah, we can we generally see how each other's have changed and stuff, right? Like oh, our mentality and stuff. But if I didn't interact with you back then. I, it's hard for me to get a good read on you if I didn't, if I don't keep up with you. Uh, so you you right. want to see like how they changed or something? Like what if they changed for the better? You know, like I'm down for that, but at the same time, it's like I didn't like you enough for me to consider you a close friend to begin with. And I'm not saying I'm not open to that, but I'm just like it's just harder. the 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 barrier of entry is significantly higher in my mind. Mm. In my mind, like personally, I'm just like the the basis was already not there. So yeah, that's that's fair, I guess. Yeah, like um, like someone that I wouldn't consider I I would consider I was close to, but I, like I I talk to on occasion now is actually Robin. Right. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. Damn. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean, dude? You got something against Robin, bro? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's been long since I heard that name. Yeah, it's just like because I would randomly meme on her art and stuff. And then we just randomly catch up, and then like we hung out like once or twice, and then I was like, "Oh, right, cool, we're cool now." But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. It was. Yeah, I think this was. We hung out back when. Did I have a job yet? I think I we got lunch in the middle of the day one time, because I didn't have a job yet. So that was last year, but um, yeah, like we chill, and like we're cool, and we talk, and then. Who else do I talk to? I'm, you do you guys do you guys talk to anyone or interact? Let me while well, I let me think of more people. But I do. Who no. do you who do you talk to, Mark? You guys. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. Thanks. Yeah, not really. Oh. I, I, okay. Go ahead. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't. Not off the top of my head. Like every day, it's every... mostly just you guys. Oh well, yeah, not like... yeah, not every day. Like I don't talk to these people every day. Yeah, I think, I think most of my friend group now is like the the friends I made in like college, or mm. like the people I met through like hard games. Mm. Yeah, I'll be now. It's like my friend group. I mean, like it, it it's not that I don't catch up with them. Like I'm I'm cool with them, right? Mm-hmm. But I like I won't go out of my way to like say hi or whatever. Hey, what's up? How are you? Etc. Right. Right. Yeah, I'm just gonna scroll through my Instagram. Marvy, Marvy's on everybody's feed. I think Marvy's <laughs> fucking hilarious. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, yeah, Marvy popped up my feed too. I just chat him once in a while. Yeah, Ugh. me too. I actually during the pandemic when I got my car, me and Marvy actually hung out, and then we went on a cruise on like a highway and stuff, and then mm. we talked about some about some stuff and life and working on stuff. He's Marvy's always been a cool dude. Reach yeah. out to him. He's such a nice guy. I'm, yeah, I'm just scrolling through my feet now. The, the people I like chat sometimes with, it's mostly like you know, it's like on rare occasions mm-hmm. if we're yeah. gonna hang out or something. It's it's Matt, Josh Sanchez, and Marvy. That's oh, it. Oh, I'm not gonna lie, almost forgot about Josh. Cause I just he, it's like he's super active sometimes, and he just disappears for like a couple months. <laughs> weird i mean that's how i see it i could but yeah i haven't seen josh in a bit either he's a nice guy i mean if i was still there in carson i'd be hanging out with everybody so but like i'm far away so no yeah do do people even know you live over there <laughs> no no <laughs> I, I didn't break the news <laughs> uh, they, they don't even know if you come back we don't even know if you can't <laughs> 
<laughs> like, I don't know if people know this place anyway, so. Dude, people will know where that is. Yeah. They can Google it. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's going through my feed again. You just oh, gotta sorry. get through messages. Let me go through it. Uh, so we're going there? We're going there to a uh, 10-year reunion? I'm down, dude. I'm chill. I'm gonna be like, hey, your kid's so cute. They look so great in all your Instagram posts. They bring their kids. Oh, shit. Dude, some of I, I'm pretty sure some of them would bring their kids. Dude, that'd be such a whiplash. Damn. Right now. That's crazy. Dude, oh, man, you know who I should see in, like, on a weekend or something? Not to hang out, but, like, I should see Dom. Dom? Dominic in his barbecue. Oh, dude. yeah. Dude. I heard about that. Dude, I was like, his food looks good. I, like, but I never, I never think of like, oh, I want barbecue, and I'll go to his thing. Every weekend or what? Yeah, it's like every, almost every Saturday, Sunday, he'll have his uh food truck pop up by a uh, go kart land. Wait, where's that? It's by uh Carson. Is it Carson Street? No. Go kart land. Nick, oh, Car the yeah, yeah, the Carson Street by the four hundred five. Oh, no, by Carnegie, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, other side of four or five. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't know that. Yeah. I didn't know it was like almost every weekend. Like I follow his Instagram page. Look makes it look good. <laughs> I'll probably stop by too. Yeah, let's go. Let's go sometime. You're like, Dom, what's up, dude? Sure. Dude, who else? Who else do I talk to? Now you I'm now you got me scrolling through my DMs, Mark. <laughs> Melvin, you guys talk to oh, I I follow Melvin. Um, I see Melvin on my feed sometimes. Sometimes, like he's got his little small business pop up thrift store. That's pretty neat. But he lives in fucking NorCal, so. <laughs> Was in NorCal now? Wow, crazy. Yeah, he goes in like Bay Area area. I forgot which city, but he's in. He's uh there. I don't know if he moved back down, but. I know that's where he was conducting business and stuff. Oh wow, impressive. I mean, yeah, like, uh, yeah. Why well, did you tell me like where these people live? Not be like pretty surprised, you know. Man, really? Yeah, like, oh wow, you moved out of SoCal. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> I mean, statistically, like this was like a, a study done like years ago. It was like uh, Americans are only or fifty percent of all Americans are will likely live in their hometown for majority of their life. So... Is that 60%? 50%? 50%. 50 oh, it's like a coin flip, yeah. And then, like, if you don't live in your hometown for majority of life, you'll be, like, more likely to either move somewhere far away and stay or be constantly moving. Right. So... Yeah, um, should, I'm out of here. Fuck you guys. <laughs> yeah, bitch, you won't. <laughs> Where are you gonna move to? Portland? Mm. Houston. He's gonna go to Texas. He's gonna go to Texas. Yeah, I thought about it. I went, <laughs> now nah, he's not gonna go northwest. It's too cold, bro. He's gonna go to Texas. Bro, Texas is freezing right now, dude. And hey, they're it's like, like snow over there, dude. Fine. You can handle yourself. And you'd be like, right, let's go snowboarding. <laughs> yeah, we went to Taiwan. <laughs> <laughs> Taiwan. That shit humid as fuck, bro. Yeah, yeah, in Taiwan, guys. <laughs> hey, who else do I see? Talk to, or like, are you like surprised sometimes when people react to your stories or what? I used to, but not anymore. I'm just like now I'm more open since I post more on Instagram. I'm like, oh, it makes more sense that people are reacting to my stories. Like, I'll I'll occasionally get like a laugh or a heart about something. I'm like, nice. I didn't know you were into this kind of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Or like, like, I got you. I made you laugh with my meme. Got you. <laughs> and I'm like, nice, dude. I'm glad like some people actually watch my stories that I wouldn't normally expect. Um, what else? Mark to wagon? Mark the wagon to wagon? Yeah, I don't remember that. Dude, he's, a, he's, a, he's like one of the hardcore weebs I know. <laughs> Holy shit. Do you remember Mark at all, Kemp? Oh man, this dude, he's the one with the uh, Itasha car. Oh. He takes, okay, and, he, or, and he's like really into cars too, so it works hand in hand. He goes to anime conventions, he puts his car on display and hey, stuff. My, yeah, my, my, my brother in law goes, goes to those car meets. 
Yeah, he's probably you're, you're probably probably uh probably seen him sometimes. Yeah, he's probably seen his car or something. I've never gone with him, but I I I I've always wanted to go. Yeah. Who else? Oh yeah, Kira talking to her again. Um, I see Raislin post a lot. She she posts a lot about kicking crab. <laughs> about her job. And oh. Her kid. Oh, her kid. Yeah, yeah. She's the one with the kid, right? That's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy how people have kids. Oh, dude. God, that kid's huge. It's like four or five. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be 29 this year, 30 next year. Damn, you're old. <laughs> you're, only a year, you're only a year younger than me. Yeah, I'm still 27. <laughs> I had to think oh. about it. I watched a video. I watched a video recently where I said twenty six. I went, when the fuck did I release this video? <laughs> and when I'm not twenty six anymore, I think. Yeah, twenty seven. Else. Fuck. Dude, oh, remember? I don't remember. I don't remember if I saw said this on podcast. I think I did. When we talked about Seattle, you know I saw Leone in fucking Seattle. She lives in Seattle. Yeah, I tell you something about this. I I, I was gonna bring her up. I didn't want to like you know dox her like that. <laughs> it's Seattle. It's a big ass city. All right. Someone's gonna watch this episode and they're gonna see all our friends. They're gonna find all our friends. Like, oh, this person has a kid. I'm gonna find them. <laughs> what the yeah. fuck? It's like, oh shit, there's near on twelve. <laughs> There aren't too many people. That was crazy. Uh, I I thought it was like kind of like amazing how like you like you found each other over there. It was a yeah, one time. She, yeah, she was. She was like the one together. time she posted on. She looks on uh social media. She was like, "Oh, Neuron's here." I'm like, "Hell yeah, bro!" Yeah, you're only there for like a week, right? Or like less than a week? Yeah, like five days. Yeah, and you like found each other. That's kind of crazy. It's pretty, it was, it's still really spontaneous. Like, I'm glad that she reached out because that trip would have been way less fun if I didn't experience that. Like, comparatively, I would have just been chilling, like, under the influence in a hotel room, you know? Yeah, yeah, you tell, yeah, you tell me it was, like, kind of boring in Seattle. Like, you did everything in, like, a day or something. Yeah, you could, you could do everything you want in Seattle. And, like, if you're not hiking, you can do everything done in two days. Yeah. Was That's it raining all. when you went? Huh? Was it raining when you went? No, it sprinkled a little bit. It was just cold without like um, too much wind. It was just naturally just cold. Because sure. we, we went in November, so it was already winter. You know? Yeah, it was like a colder season, you're right. That shit, the sun would set at fucking 4 p.m. I'd make me, I could make, <laughs> I'd get so sad. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> okay, I need natural sunlight, dude. I can't live off a fucking TV screen or like a, a lamp, dude. I can't. Uh... That shit's uh, depressing. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can kind of do that. <laughs> it's kind of, I'd like get out of my room, but you know, that's it. <laughs> All right, so back back to the high school thing. Who who did you hang out with in high school that you don't really talk to anymore? Like that, just because like you would talk to them pretty commonly because you saw them on a regular basis. Uh, it's in high school. Yeah, I know. Yeah, fucking like Mark would talk about fucking Pedro a lot. Oh <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, like uh, Pedro and Edgar, the combo, the solution. <laughs> the solution. Oh, shit! <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. I totally forgot about his nickname, bro. The solution. Oh, wait, didn't I tell you guys? Is we graduated it? No. He graduated in like a he has he has like a, a math degree. Math? Okay. Yeah. He's literally he's the, the solution. solution. <laughs> what the math. fuck? That's funny. For real? Yeah. Like is he going into like research or is he going into in t into teaching? I have no clue. Well, how did you Just find about... out? Of course Pedro. <laughs> oh, okay. But, but that was a long time ago, so I, I have no clue. That's what still pretty does. awesome. That's pretty awesome, actually. The solution. Dude, how did he get that nickname again? I forgot. I don't remember. <laughs> uh, I totally forgot yeah, he had it. When, when you brought up the solution, I fucking remember that, dude. <laughs> yeah. 
Dude, now I remember of like that shitty seventh period, dude. Check. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even remember who that teacher was. It was like she was a staff there, but she was like one of the African <laughs> teachers. So she had the accent, and you're like the other the other students make fun of her. I'm like, I feel bad. But then it just became a meme because we had her for so often. Check. <laughs> Dude, you would Mark would say that shit when he came back from the fucking Philippines, dude. Never played Minecraft. Holy shit! Heck. <laughs> oh my gosh. Who else do I have? Who went? Who went to your schools? Let's go with that. People who stayed. Who went to your schools? Like in college? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh... there, there's a lot of people went to Long Beach. A lot of people went to Irvine, and there's only a handful of us that went to Berkeley. I can I can literally name everyone who went to Berkeley from our class on one hand. Uh, that one person. There's Jose, there was only three of there's only four of us. Jose Jose and James went to Irvine. Marvy went to Irvine. Yeah, Marvy went to Irvine. I never saw Marvy, but he went to Irvine, I guess. Lawrence went to Irvine. Yeah, Lawrence went to Irvine. Dude, we need to pull uh, up that goddamn uh, our high school newspaper where they posted where everyone was gonna go. Someone else went to Irvine. Dude, um, a lot of people went to Irvine, yeah. dude. Uh, Ashley Cruz went to Irvine, I think. Oh, Francis. Oh, Francis, yes. Francis went to Irvine. Someone else did too. I forgot who. A lot of people. I think that's it, what I can remember off the top of my head. You think any of them would go to the reunion? That we haven't already mentioned? Uh... Maybe Rant. Just, I don't know. He seemed like kind of a sociable guy. Yeah. I didn't really see him much. But... <clears throat> yeah, okay. What about you, Mark? A lot of people went to Long Beach. Okay, let me, let me think. Like a lot of people. That was like the Mary. second most po There. Okay, we talked about her. Cause she, cause she was my classmate. Oh, she was? For what class? Public speaking. That was a quote, cool, okay. Yeah. And then Marisol. Oh my god, Marisol. Holy shit. I I to <laughs> totally forgot about Marisol. And then I think I think his name's Kevin, the tall one. Capilad? No. Like Who's the other Kevin? He's tall. I, I think his name is Kevin. Yo, dude, there's only two Kevins that I know. The taller one was Capilad. The other one was Mendoza. He wasn't that tall. The, who's the... He who's... looks like Edgar, but taller and skinny. Yeah, dude, I don't know. He's Mexican? Yeah, and he goes to the Boys and Girls Club sometimes. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Alright, but there's, there's that dude. There's... I think her name is Michelle? From AMA. Had a... Oh, 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 I, I know who you're talking about. I know who you're talking about. I know her, yeah. There's a uh, Matt. Of course. Do you, oh, hold on, Kemp. Do you, do you know these people? You don't know the Kevin? No. I you, know Mendoza. Yeah, do, you know, do you know who Michelle was? Nope. Uh, Michelle... Uh, what's her last name? Da... 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 Adding, <laughs> yeah, really? yeah. I Adding? think that's her last name. She was in Kira's friend group. Yeah, she was in Amy. She's in Amy. Uh, I don't remember. Okay, okay. Next, <laughs> next. Uh, there was Mariana. I always hanged out there. Oh yeah, she got her masters, huh? She got a masters. I fought. I have her on Instagram. That's pretty cool. I, I think she. Yeah, every time you say her name, I'm just like, who? <laughs> oh, I know it's she's Who? engaged and she's in Florida. What the fuck? Last, last she's time in, I talked to her, she's in what? In Florida. Oh, in, Florida. And engaged. she's engaged. Wow. Wow. Interesting. Uh, I don't think who else went to. I mean, I didn't go to Long Beach, so I don't know. Else, who? Are... Who's who's the 
Is it, it wasn't Chris. Who's the guy in our year that played volleyball that was really good? Was he not our year? He played for Long Beach's team when they won the championship. Long Beach? Forgot. Maybe he wasn't our year. He might not have been our year. Might have been the year after us. But it's okay. Is there anyone, anyone else notable? Maybe not from your school, just that you just remember. A lot of people went to LA also, actually. You said like UCLA or? Yeah, UCLA. But the, you know, Diane went there. Didn't both Diane and Francis went there? Oh, yeah, Francis went there. Who else went? I'm trying to think of like people's graduation photos <laughs> that like years ago. They all took the photos on the same steps. Oh, oh <laughs> same step, yeah. Because you know, like you, that's what UCLA is known for. Like, oh, these are the steps, right? I'm like, yeah. you guys not have any other nice buildings to take pictures in front of? They're like, no. <laughs> uh. Oh. Berkeley. Like I said, it was only four of us from our year. It was me, Kate, Carlo, and Jen. Oh, yeah, Kate went to her. Fine. Huh? It, huh? Yeah, Kate went to her. I mean, or, um, um, Berkeley. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, I was like, did, I, was like did, she... did, I, did I just get did I just get gaslit right now? <laughs> I thought she was like getting her master's over there now. <laughs> yeah, I was like, wait, I thought you said you don't follow people. <laughs> uh, I, I remember this Kate. This Kate, that's it. You don't remember Kate. You remember this Kate. Yes, this Kate. Kate. Yeah. yeah. This no, no Kate. the one that went to Berkeley with you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I remember that Kate. Yeah, I, I, dude, I don't know. I, I, as soon as we went to Berkeley, Carlo like fucking disappeared. I don't know what happened. Yeah, to him. No, dude, that that dude always had his own agenda, dude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Which is interesting, but I respect that. He knew what he wanted to do. I, I, I didn't even know what he wanted was to he do. Was he in politics or something like that? Yeah. I thought he was engineering. Was he? I don't know. He did a lot of shit. I don't... <laughs> Again, he didn't... He's also not the type to be on social media anyway, so I didn't yeah. know what he did. I just know he would. He was just cool with, like, all the culinary kids and Miss Kelly from uh, Carson, but that was about it. I didn't know much about him. I can't wait to see Carlo run for president in 10 years. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> nice. You heard it here first, dude. You you don't you're not even that close to him. Like I can't wait for well, him to run. Wasn't he a valedictorian? He he was a he was a valedictorian. Yes. Yeah. Oh man, Julia. We talked about Julia in the car. Yeah. What is she doing? Did she move somewhere? I'm not sure where she moved to, but I know she has a kid, and she's married. <laughs> yeah oh, it's, that's all I know too I think you're right though I'm pretty sure she doesn't live in California though where did she go to school? did she go out of state? <clears throat> I have no Did she, no she went to LA oh she also went to LA? she went to LA for sure yeah 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 I, I, I remember seeing her grad photos yeah she's for sure LA UCLA um, that's how she went to Cal Poly Pomona I see. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> I swear I thought she went to LA. Or I think it was someone else. Uh, Pomona, Pomona had a good amount of people too, actually. Yeah. Cinco. No, he didn't go to Pomona. He went to. I thought he went to Slow. Oh, he went to Slow. Never mind. He went to Pomona. Did, did Ariel go to Pomona or is she also Slow? No, she's also Slow. Ariel? Ariel? She went to Irvine. The one who lived like, Never mind. The one who lived like next yeah, the one down your block. Yeah, she goes. <laughs> go did... What? Go ask her. Go. Ask. <laughs> hey, um, Miron and uh, Mark are interested. Where you went? <laughs> can you confirm? <laughs> and and can you update me on what your life is? <laughs> yeah, can we catch up real quick? Go bring the mic with you. <laughs> Just yeah, Discord right. on your phone. <laughs> reporting. <laughs> reporting live in front of Ariel's house. I'm going to doorbell right now. Let's see if she still lives here. <laughs> yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't even know if she still lives there. Oh, man. 
Did you see that? It was this part to say it. Yeah. Maybe a seed. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, wasn't she part of that one too? She was part of ABS CBN. <laughs> no fucking way, dude. Don't no, I'm pretty me. sure she was. I could don't be wrong. Out, so we're gonna yeah. call it ABS CBN now. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the acronym was. No shot, bro. I, I I used to walk her home. No shot, she was there. Okay, she wasn't there. Okay, okay. Who? Okay, I guess I'm thinking of someone else. Who else? The only reason why I remember was I I was talking to Ariel, like. Freshman year of college or something. I think we were just catching up online or something, and mm-hmm. she just told me that she. Oh no no, this was in high school. This wasn't college. It was in high school because we were taking uh, a tour around campuses, and she was in our in our peer period, right? Camp, right? Yeah. I'm, the only reason I remember is she went to either Poly Cal Poly Pomona or Slow because they were the um, liberal arts, right? And she wanted to go into hospitality. I was like, oh, that's that's a unique one. Don't remember right. which one. I want to say it was slow though. The slow had the better program, from what she told me. So that was like her her dream local school. Uh, I think that's the only thing I remember about Ariel. After high school, I don't remember what she did. It's like local, but you move all the way to Nor- NorCal. <laughs> slow, slow's not NorCal. Where is slow? No, it's it's like... San Luis Obispo, right? Yeah, that's like two hours along the coast. Yeah. Oh shit. That's not. That's not. That's like central. I was, I was I was still considered so color, but no, oh. like central, but it's along the coast. <laughs> There's no such thing as Central California. Yeah, there is. There is. What no the one did no, the, the, no one calls it that because there's nothing interesting there to begin with. <laughs> it's just mountains. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like I would say, like Malibu is halfway up towards from here to slow. Maybe maybe less than half, like forty percent of the way up okay. to slow. But it's like, yes. yeah, it's, it's definitely on the coast. Yeah, that's why I still consider semi-local, because it's like... Who else, who else was interesting? <laughs> Is there anyone that you would like to catch up with? You know, you say that, but then I feel like I wouldn't know until I saw their face be like, oh shit, you're cool. <laughs> oh, when you see their face. Yeah, I'll be like... <sighs> I don't think of people off the top of my head because it's like for people I follow on social media, if I think they're cool, I already interact with them. Like, I think Marvy's fucking hilarious. I'll, I'll message that guy, dude, like once a month. Right. Yeah. <laughs> but and then who else? I need to catch up with Jen, actually. I told her I'd catch up with her this year. Yeah, I know what Jen's been doing ever since um, with Josh, right? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah kind of worried for her you know yeah but if i was really worried i'd catch up with her you know yeah uh, so I'm, I'm just doing my own thing sorry i mean she's she's always done her own thing you know so who else who else who are you, mark? yeah who do you want to catch uh, up with mark you want to catch up with i uh. Yeah, Mark hates people, dude. We 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 had this discussion, dude. No new yeah, friends. I'm the same as Mark. <laughs> no new friends, even if they were old friends. <laughs> yeah, the only one I really want to catch up with is probably Julia. Dude, oh my god, dude, you want to know what who what Antonio's doing? <laughs> huh? Dude, dude, I think I feel like he's the person we would want to know what's what we up to, dude. Know, Wait, who? Antonio. Antonio. <laughs> I feel like I, that's see that's the name. I'm be like, dude, what Just the fuck like, are you up to, bro? <laughs> like I had his number, then it's like just disappeared yeah yeah me too that like that number just stopped working <laughs> yeah it's like those you. things <laughs> dude why are you just like doesn't even live here anymore man <laughs> dude then i'd like to know that <laughs> yeah oh my god dude th- i think that's the person i want to know is antonio dude who else who else is interesting that i haven't that i don't catch up with normally Dude, you still talk to Brandon or no? Chong? Yeah. It's kind of hard to, you know, get a Why? message from I don't know. I think he's, like, busy sometimes or, like, with his girlfriend. I have no clue. He just disappears by himself? Yeah. I don't know. It's whatever. But I, I messaged him, like, maybe, like, three weeks ago. Uh-huh. But it's just saying, like, 
that he's just busy, but he's like busy with his girlfriend. So he said, "It's kind of impressive right. that you messaged him three three weeks ago." Yeah, that's pretty recent, dude. Yeah. Like really? as a, as an adult, three weeks within a month that's pretty recent. <laughs> yeah. Well, I never got a reply back. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you never got a reply back, but yeah, that's sad. Sad, yeah. I always have to like double message if I need a reply, but now nah, yeah. lazy. That's kind of like you though. <laughs> that's kind of like you though yeah dude like mark will never respond in, in our group chat unless i tag him so he knows yeah, that the question is directed at him <laughs> yeah yeah but, but before you got back like i don't know if you'd ever respond to us honestly <laughs> dude he'd res no he would respond he would respond again this is the same thing from last week mark would only respond at the most like unoptimal times for himself he'd be like guys I'm in the middle of a storm. We have no power. I'm like, why the fuck are you messaging us? <laughs> <laughs> Am I wrong though? T tell me I'm wrong. That shit was, and then he'd be like, he sent like a low quality video of like the power and then the floods. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. oh my God. I'm like, Mark, what's up, dude? Like you alive? He went, yeah, I'm alive. I can't, I can't, I can't go to school. Can't go to school. It's sort of flooded. I'm like, all right, sounds good. What do you want me to do? About it? What do you want? Like, <laughs> that's that's how our that's how Mark's updates went. And then and then I check him and check in with him like a week later and be like, hey Mark, I heard the typhoon's done. He's like, yeah, street's still flooded though. <laughs> I'm like, damn dude, kind of sucks. Sucks to be you, man. Wish we were playing Minecraft. He goes, yeah, I miss you guys. And then he disappeared. He didn't even. <laughs> <laughs> he disappeared. <laughs> like honestly, like he would. That's. It, it felt like it was like a half thought. He would say something, but then he never would expand. <laughs> yeah. But, oh my gosh. And then and, and then he's and then he'll pop up randomly, like you know, in in uh, Philippine time, right? It'd be like the most random time of the day for us, and then he'd be like. Because this is the same time where Mark, or Mark, where Kemp was working like graveyard, right? So then everyone was awake up different times, and then Mark would be like, "You guys want to have a meeting of the pa the uh, the paper bag meeting? Paper bag. <laughs> <laughs> it's our yearly meeting. It's our yearly meeting. <laughs> and then it changed from the paper bag to the fucking the the X wing star Star Wars filter. Remember that shit? Yeah. Do we still have that photo? I hope we still have those photos. Those are you good photos. That photo. It's somewhere in the group chat. I know they exist because we made a we made a fucking banner out of or not a banner, a collage out of it. I know it exists. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, that's just Mark. So, uh, you know, we need we need to update it. <laughs> <laughs> we we need we need a new filter that we can all use. <laughs> oh my goodness! Uh, that's the annual meeting. Well, it's no longer an, it's not even an annual meeting anymore because at least you're back in the country, dude. Did we even have a meeting last year? No. <laughs> we, we didn't just know. Had him in person. Yeah, we <laughs> we just had him in person. Like we we saw him before he left for the Philippines again in the winter. So yeah. that was that was our meeting. Are you sure? But we never had like a meeting meeting. And yeah, we saw him like a month ago. <laughs> Yeah, so that, that 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 fulfills both 2022 and 23. Yeah. Oh man. Okay. Speaking of like people in your area, right? Hot single moms in your area, dude. Actually, you know, um, Desi, the 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 one we saw and hung out with. You know how she's been yeah. being like a a a dental student, professional person, to be a dentist. Dude, she's actually when I come back from Japan, she's gonna take care of my teeth. Oh yeah, she's gonna she's gonna do X rays, full mouth ex inspection and cleaning. I'm like, yeah, free dental care. She was like, yeah, yeah. If you know anyone, so if you guys want to get free dental care, in like late spring or March, it's only on Tuesdays and Thursdays though. In my area, whatever city that she worked in. Remember how she said she commutes? Temecula. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. So, all the way in Temecula. Hey man, I'd rather. Commute to, to Temecula for like an hour and get free health care when That's I don't smart. have good hands when I don't have good dental. <laughs> you know? How far is how far is Temecula from 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 where you live, Mark? 
20 minutes. Isn't it like... Right? I'm going I'm to I'm Google map it right now. Yeah, go, yeah Google map it. Fact check. I could, I could have sworn that show was far. I mean, uh, Mark's, I like... Mark's far in general, but I'd still rather go get free dental health care, dude. Like, like, uh, like a full examination. I'd rather like go. 20, 30 minutes. And that's north no, for her. Like that's, fast, right? that's north for you, though, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's about like 20 minutes. North? North. It's, Temecula is north of you, right? South. South. It's south? Oh, fuck. So how far is it for us, Kemp? Uh, Temecula? Two, yeah. Two, one hour, two hours. That's not two hours. <sighs> it's two hours if traffic sucks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, it's about like... Hour twenty. Yeah, that's not bad. Hour fifteen. I'll, I'll, dude. I'd rather do that than wait in the. Well, den right now. That's the same. The, yeah. the ninety-one usually traffic. <laughs> I mean, I'd rather do that than wait in the dent the dentist office for an hour. It's the same thing. My waiting room is my car rather than the actual waiting room. <laughs> what if you had to wait over there for an hour? <laughs> Hell, no, no, no. I, I, I would be like the only person she works on for that day. Okay, I guess maybe question mark. Who knows. You guys, if you guys want to get your teeth cleaned, you hit her up, dude. She, she yeah, can... you can go there and I'll, I'll hang out with Mark or something and he pick me up again. <laughs> That's true. I'll hang Drop out with... Drop him off. <laughs> Drop him off. I'll have a play date with Mark. <laughs> no, honestly, honestly, if I have an appointment on Tuesday, we can do that. That's not... I'm not even joking. Like, if... Because the appointments are either on, like I said, Tuesday or Thursday. If you still have your schedule... You should have your schedule in April. It's only like a, a, two months away, right? I could pick you up in like Tuesday morning and then we go over or drop you off at Mark's house, have your play date. I'll get my appointment. I'll hang out with Dez and then I'll see, I'll pick you up after and we'll have dinner or something and we'll go home. <laughs> yeah. Me and Mark. Wait, Mark, can you drive? <clears throat> yeah. Why? Okay. Yeah. We can, we can go, go somewhere too. Hold on. When he, when he means, can Mark you, too. as in, do you have a car? Yeah, like, do you have a car? <laughs> not, not can you, <laughs> <laughs> not can you, as in, do you have the ability to, <laughs> do you yeah, have the technology? Can you physically drive? <laughs> can you operate the machinery? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh man. Pretty interesting though. Honestly, I think. Okay, a random, random question. I'm going back to the reunion. If someone you thought was like you didn't really talk to, but you thought they were cool and they weren't like putting up a front, would you be friends with them again, and or friends with them, a new friendship? Yeah, why not? I, don't, I asked Mark because he said no new friends. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I mean, I feel like Kemp would be cool, but you're only going because I'm going. Who's cool? I'm cool with people. We're all cool. Like, I, 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 I think I told you this before, but like. I've like kind of like kind of tried to avoid all these people from high school. Uh huh. Not like not like actively avoid, but like I won't like go out of my way to like to like uh like react to their uh like stories about having on social stuff like that, you know. Mm -hmm. Like stay like incognito. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. so, so, if they were to reach out to you, yeah, yeah, cool, cool. I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be an asshole and ghost them. Yeah, you, you could be. <laughs> I could. You could be. Leave yeah. them on, leave them on red, dude. Yeah, I could. I've done that to people, but it's like, I could, but I probably won't. Dude. If I knew them, I won't. But if we weren't close, like maybe. Oh yeah. I'm like on Google Maps. I found fucking. I found Michi tacos. Oh my god. I'm just like hovering around the hills and Oh Michi tacos. <laughs> pupusas? You say pupusas? <laughs> oh my gosh. But hi G for us. Yeah, Aslan eats like three, two dozen eggs. How much is two a dozen? Twelve? So Twenty four eggs? Uh. Yeah. A lot of eggs. I mean, that's cool. You think, man, who else would be interesting? I wonder if anyone became like an actual, like famous, not famous, but like if anyone became like an artist or 
Hold on, chef. oh dude, if they become famous, I don't want to. I don't want to go with them. <laughs> Wait, why? I don't want to go with them. Why? What? What's the? What's the reason of you not, not wanting to? If they're famous, they're famous, they have a lot of attention. I, I don't want to be part of that attention. Nope. Damn, dude, I'm not famous, bro. <laughs> I don't want to be part of that attention. Damn. Well, well, Niran, if, you, if you become famous, it's like it's a different story because I've talked with you the whole time, right? Yeah, I'll be like, hey, hey, yeah. guys, I'm famous. This guy also needs to be famous. He's my yeah. he's my rock. No, yeah, I don't I don't want to be famous. I don't ever want to be famous. I want to yeah. be rich. But I don't want to be famous. Do you know there's a within our class there's I think one doctor. It, really only, already? Only one? John? So. Are no. you gonna say John? No, 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 no. He didn't because... graduate from Carson. Yeah, that's also true. I was gonna say that. He's, he's but technically there's one that graduated. Who's Only... the doctor? Uh, he's that football player. Uh, his name's Aaron, I think. Oh, oh, fucking. Oh, what's his last uh, name? I heard he was going to med school. Aaron, fuck, last name. I don't know his last name. Dyson, Dyson, Dyson. It is it Dyson. Is it Dyson? I think that's it's Dyson. Aaron. It's hard That's the only Aaron I know from Cards Night. Okay, then it he, yeah, he's the black one, right? Yeah, black yeah. Aaron? Yeah, 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 that's him. I think that's him. Yeah. Because I, I, I didn't know that. All I know he did track and field, and then I think he got injured. That's all I remember, because he stopped posting on social media too. I didn't realize he was a how did you know he was a doctor? Uh you know when you like reminisce with friends, you look back, see who's, you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. Dude, oh my god. Kev, remember that thing I told you? Remember James? He never reached out to us. James. Is Copeland? It Copeland? James? The one that Irvine? Yeah, he went to Irvine, yeah. What does he do now? I don't know. He lived in Japan. He did? He did. Well, you're going to Japan. Yeah, but I'm not going to live there. You can hit him up. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be there anymore. Oh, but so he's not living in Japan. <laughs> no, he was living in there, and then I think he's moving back. Oh, he's moving back, I see. I think he lived there during... COVID? Pandemic, yeah. Oh, that sounds... So he was stuck there. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like he was stuck there. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if he was... Hey, but living there is still living there, you know? Still something. I guess, yeah. Yeah, that sounds kind of bad. I could but, be I wrong. Mean, if you ever ask... He's coming back, he's coming back. That's why. Yeah, I mean, if he, if he, if he hits you up, you know? Yeah. That's oh, crazy. Right. That's how you live there. Yeah, going to, I'm going to Japan. I'm not going to live there. Fuck it. I'll tell you guys how it is. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting just coming out of this. James and Jose. Yeah, him and Jose. I don't know what happened to Jose. I mean, Jose was always the quiet type. Oh, they're both quiet. <laughs> That's also true. They're both quiet. I've known them since elementary school. Really? <laughs> yeah, we went to Carroldale. I don't know. They're that. cool, though. Yeah. Are they cool, though? <laughs> Mark, cool. are, are they're they? Cool. Are they're you cool. just saying that? No, they're, they're cool. Like, hey, James. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, quiet. I you're, you're... play video games. Instead. Yeah, your definition of cool is very um relaxed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Mark. Hey, James. See, yeah, they were cool. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh my god. Were you? How many people were you? Were you cool with then, Mark? If you were like that with everybody, I feel like you were cool with all the ATCA people. Is what's ATCA? The the teaching one, Zland. Okay. A A A E E, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, no. <laughs> Everybody. Because you were part, like you were. You All were, the groups. Yeah, because you were <laughs> part of like street dance and stuff, and like street dance was like a lot of, or a lot of the dancers was ATCA. Yeah. Yeah, but I used to hang out with most of them before. Remember the the box. From middle school? Yeah. Yeah, all people from the box all went to fucking ATC, yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess that's enough that's enough high school reminiscing. I mean, is there anything about Japan you guys want me to see or do? I'm gonna be driving go-karts, I'm going to Universal Japan. I'm gonna go eat a lot of good food. Okay, have you been to Universal Japan uh, Universal over here? With nope. Mario and that, whatever? Nope. Oh. The plan was to go and remember we were supposed to go in October and I was supposed to see it before it opened here, but then we canceled, so now people here get to see it before I go to Japan. But I'm still going to Universal because they have all the anime shit. 
sure, yeah. They, have, I think they have like the One Piece, Attack on Titan. Yeah, tell me, how that, tell, me, tell me how crowded it is. Uh, I know it should be pretty crowded. Yeah, we'll see. They, they they have like a tier system of how they price their tickets based off how busy they think it is. They have A, B, and C, yeah. where A is the is the least crowded, C is the most crowded. The day we decided to go is the weekend is actually B tier. So they should think it's medium packed. Yeah, actually, um, um, yesterday I I dropped off my parents at the airport. There, they went to the Philippines. Ooh, nice. They went. They went by Japan. Did they and go to Universal? A... <laughs> no, no, no. They were only there for like a layover, but uh, it was super light that morning. Well, that's good. Yeah. I mean, all the tourists are already there. Yeah, I think most people take their flights at night to Japan. Oh yeah, that makes sense because it's a overnight flight. Yeah, and then the Japan airline was like, uh, they have their flight at noon to I'll be, Narita. I'll be flying into Japan via Japan Airlines. Oh, at night? From, from, yeah, overnight from Philippines. Oh, for sure. My flight's going to be from 11.45 to 6 in the morning. Wait, are you going straight to the Philippines? Or? I'm going straight to the Philippines. No, no, actually, I have a layover. Um, yeah, they were right. Being a China Air, and then... Two hour layover in Taiwan and then to Manila. And then right after awesome. Manila, I have like a few hours of downtime, but then I take my private flight to the island resort right after. Yeah, right. So, for the wedding, crazy rich Asian wedding, baby. That's nice. Tell me about that. I, I'm, I'm actually more excited about your, that wedding than uh, whatever you're going to do in Japan. Okay. I mean, because you can't go to the wedding, but you can go to Japan. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm going to experience it eventually, but I don't know what the fuck this crazy Asian wedding is, right? Yeah, I mean, <sighs> I'll let you know. We, I can't take... I can't... They are going to strictly enforce a known, no phone ceremony and reception because oh, sure. they want to, like, you know, keep it real personal. They don't want to post stuff on social and stuff. Oh, yeah. I, I don't want... I don't care about a picture. I just want to know how it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, for sure, dude. It's open bar. I'm yeah. probably going to get wasted. I don't know. <laughs> oh, duh. here we go again. Here we go again. I'm a blackout. <laughs> I, I, I probably won't blackout, but I'll, I'll have a good time because uh, I, don't know, I don't know... I don't know if I'll know people there. You know what I mean? Because they said... Oh, you, only, you only know the, the bride? Yeah. Uh -huh. So like I know yeah. the I know the bride and they said there's roughly like 140 150 guests coming out of that 150 I don't know who's going. All right, good luck. You got this. I believe. Family, you know. <laughs> I dude, I don't even I don't I know mean, the family, dude. dude. Mean, yeah, if they invited you, that means uh that means something. I mean yeah. I, I mean out of the 150, I'm sure they invited like 300 plus cuz you know, not everyone's going to go to a destination wedding. Um yeah, kind of but at the same time, like, you know, they have the money to be able to invite people to do an, an, an innovation uh wedding right and it's not even like w will i even know who i wouldn't even know who's related to who right because it's like you know the, the groom side's got to bring a bunch of people and then this bride side i'm like my chance of knowing someone is like 10 percent well uh, time to flex your uh whatever social skills you have I know, dude. Let me get a let me get, drink some liquid courage. Once I get a drink yeah, in me, hey, we're hey, we're fucking. It's gonna be the same thing in Seattle. Be like, hey, what's up? And I add a bunch of people from Seattle. They're fucking tight. You want liquid <laughs> courage? Drink gin. Damn, dude. Are you advocating gin? <laughs> is gin your favorite or what? Or does it make you the most messed up? It gives them the most courage. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. the above. Mark's like, Henny, don't do it for me no more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm, I'm miss you. Are you, Jay? Are you gonna miss me? Yeah, because I won't stream for like two weeks. Kind of crazy. Um, well, I mean, we'll figure it out. I mean, it, is there anything you guys want me to be aware of or want to know other than the wedding while I'm in Japan or Philippines? I want you to have fun, you know. You, you be deserve safe. to be uh, safe. Yeah, be safe. Have fun. I'll get scammed in uh, Akihabara, Shinjuku. <laughs> yeah, go get taken into like a soap plant by this girl or something, and then like get massaged by a guy, and then. Sure. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! That's not. <laughs> I meant scammed monetarily, not like that. <laughs> oh wait, you, you're definitely gonna get scammed monetarily anyway. So. <laughs> Did you want any figures or stuff? Candy. Nah. Uh, I mean, if I uh, maybe, but uh, don't 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 mind me. 
Okay, I'll have to figure out if I can take if I can get stuff uh, tax free via the VAT yeah, yeah. duty free if you, stuff. If you, if you can get me something, just surprise me. <laughs> All right, I'll get you a uh, quarter quarter scale uh, Sandra Gahara. How about that? Sheesh, dude. You you can suck my dick for it. Sheesh. Mark, you want anything from Japan? <laughs> Got the milk crew. Surprise me. I'll bring you a um. Mail order bride. Is that is that joke distasteful? I don't know. <laughs> yes. I'll I take anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, Neron, there's one thing I want you to bring back. What's up? Uh, get get some strong zero for us. What? Get some strong zero for us. Oh shit! Can I bring that? That's like carbonated, man. So <laughs> yeah, that's kind of dangerous. That's that's the one thing I want you to bring for us. Pop in the airplane. Dude, um, that sh that shit's also gonna be really heavy too. In cans uh, and liquid. Yeah, my uh, I had uh, my my friend's coworker. He he was able to bring some back. How do you do it? Yeah, you how do you like just put in his it, luggage? You it, yeah, you gotta wrap it. Yeah, you gotta Yeah, I need a bunch of pit newspaper. Uh, maybe like some like bubble wrap. Oh, fuck! You can I have to get bubble wrap. You need, like you need like double Ziploc, triple. Yeah, so I have to buy. I have to buy Ziplocs. <laughs> it's gonna like pop. Yeah, the first get like, one. Get like six or something. I don't know. I, like <laughs> I feel like we're gonna have it and be like, eh, well, I, we can get like fucking cut water from Bevmo. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that, that, that that's the one thing I want. I would like you to bring back. Tell you what, tell you what. Me and Victor will get messed up in the hotel room on strong zeros and tell you if it's good. <laughs> yeah, but I want to experience it too. You should, okay. you should try a uh, strong zero dry. What does dry mean? I saw you dry. <laughs> I never knew what dry, uh, dry is like yeah, the mouth feel, know. right? Dry is like yeah. the mouth feel. All right. Well, I mean, we'll see. I'll. I'm sure me and me and Victor will definitely be drinking. Well, we're gonna also try and see if we can get into theme bars and stuff too. I kind of want to. I I don't even watch JoJo. I want to go to the JoJo bar just to make just to try out the drinks. But I'm sure that shit's really packed. Yeah. All the weebs are there. So. All right. Let's uh wrap up. I need to use restroom. Okay, yeah, let's end it, end the podcast. We're gonna play some Zombie Army uh, four after this. Um, but yeah, so stick around. Say bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. Bye. Oh, oh, any any last shout outs? Plugs? Um, Genshin and updates? Yeah, there's a Genshin update next week. We'll play it. Okay, Mark, anything for you? Shout outs to Neuron. You, could, you know. Would, would you call me? <laughs> shout outs to Neuron. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, thanks for watching, guys. It's a pretty chill episode. We're, we're just dropping a bunch of names that no one knows. This episode is more for us than for anyone else. Dude, for real, like, dude, we just doxed a bunch of people. Not even, dude. <laughs> Fucking Leone's in Seattle. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? You're doxing everyone. Stop right. doxing people, man. All right. If you if you watch this whole, the video all the way through, uh, comment how to dox yourself. Where are you from? <laughs> yeah, tell me where you're from. Yeah, tell me where you're from, dude. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. I'll see you on a podcast in like a probably like three weeks oh, yeah, to a lot. month. So that's the last one before you leave. Yeah, it's the last one. So I mean everyone wish I have a safe trip. <laughs> if you're watching on YouTube. Otherwise, I'll still do a couple streams um before I think I'll probably stream on Tuesday <laughs> on my last stream. Watch his vlog. <laughs> Dude, I, sure. dude, I might, I might actually record and then reinstall Adobe Premiere Pro just to edit videos. I kind of want to do a couple reels and do a couple videos. On Tuesday. We're gonna get dinner on Tuesday. Hey, can you do a TikTok on Japan for me? <laughs> I'll, do, I'll, I'll do a you a Instagram reel, dude. I'll edit an Instagram reel for you. Wow. Um, but uh, Kemp, remind me, remind me Tuesday. When, when, and where? What you want to get? Hopefully, it's not too heavy. I don't want to get like fat before Japan again. So. Sure. Because I'm I'm gonna come back like ten pounds heavier. That's not even like a joke. Sure. That's what that's how it happens. Okay, well anyways, we'll talk about this off stream. So bye you bye yeah, YouTube. Mushroom, mushroom, bye. Mushroom, mushroom, bye. Mushroom.